Get ready for the smackdown. Get ready for the smackdown. How you gonna react when you're put in the back Cause there's no turning back when you're facing the smackdown. Hey guys, Mom Vernon Kid here coming to you again with the fights. For section 11. Uh, this one comes from Simquan. Uh, and he put this one together. And it's kind of a handicap match, but he fits the Predator versus Udnot Rex and Udnot Grunt. Yeah. Kind of a handicap match. Uh, but I said I'd do it for no problem. So let's kick it off with the Predator. Now you've heard of Craven the Hunter and all the great hunters out there in fiction. But let's let's face it guys, they ain't nothing like the Predator. The Predator is an intergalactic hunter that has hunted many creatures over the years. And these creatures these alien this alien race which I know the alien race's name but I, I it's hard to pronounce for me guys forgive me um, is really really the uber and ultimate hunter very smart very adaptable it really they really calculatedly get to know their prey their core they have pretty much advanced technology for example, their most famous is to bend the light around them so they can optic camouflage. They have these laser beams, shoulder cannons on their shoulders. They have these spears. They have this incredible net that pretty much it, 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 it tightens around you. Uh, they have this like shuriken, like uh, chakram, like blade that would just cut through anything. Um, and to think that in their their races are not all, you know, they're all not like old lovey-dovey with each other. There's the big ones, and then you got the smaller ones. The, But they all are dangerous and very, very, very exceptional at what they do. And they're probably one of the most famous aliens in cinema and comics. So, moving on to his, it, it's combatant. Yeah, we got two Krogans going at it. The Krogans, the race from Mass Effect. And the two Krogans that I'm talking about is Ertnot Rex and Ertnot Grunt. They are from the same clan, Ertnot. Now, Rex, we are first introduced to Rex in the first Mass Effect. And he came off as this badass, just... This is the guy you, you don't want to push around or mess with. And anytime somebody, like, be careful, Rex, or we're going to have to take you down. And Rex was like, <laughs> I'd like to see you try. And But Rex was smart. He, 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 knew, he wanted to help his people. Because we all know that at the beginning of the Mass Effect universe, you know, the, the, the Krogan, they could not reproduce. The Genophase was condemned them. But as Krogans, Krogans are tough as nails. These guys, you don't take them down with just a little handgun. And Rex proved himself in the first game. And then the second game comes out and we're introduced to another Krogan who was pretty much the ultimate Krogan, purebred Krogan, and that's Grunt. And Grunt comes along and he is just as badass as Rex, or maybe even more. But with him, he was built to fight. And, and fighting was his thing, you know. Fighting, it's all that he loved, you know. It's, you know, he, he was built, bred to fight. And we're also introduced more to Grunt in the third one. Both Rex and Grunt come back, and they both prove once again that the Krogans are just as badass 
of alien race in the Mass Effect universe than anything. And it was always fun to watch the Krogans. They always carried their traditional weapon of choice was this huge shotgun that pretty much only their race can carry. Because if a human tried to, it'll literally break every bone in your body. The kickback was so strong. Um, but most Krogans are, you know, it was always the thing. When you're fighting a Krogan, if they charge in at you, get out of the way. <laughs> Just get out of the way. They always said, a Krogan charging, get out of the way. And that was something that I always uh, loved about uh, the Krogans. But they were, it was always, it was good to help them free them from the genophase at the end of Mass Effect 3. Um, but these two Krogans are just extremely, extremely badass and pretty much would make one hell of a team if they were to team up. So, moving on to a battle between this, these two alien races. Now, once again, this is a handicap match. So it's one Predator against two Krogans. Predator has advanced technology, yes indeed, and he would really study the Krogans very well, Rex and Grunt, but if Rex and Grunt are able to, let's just say, occupied in a situation that, you know, they can handle this, but of course you gotta also put in the factor that if the Predator is always, you know what it does, it do 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 and blow itself up so it could take both Rex and Grunt out just like that. But what if it actually went down fighting? Could the Predator be able to handle both Rex and Grunt? Or will one of them die and one shall live? Or will both the Predator be able to take down Rex and Grunt at the same time? and then die you know uh there's a lot of things you got to play into this guys it this was a very interesting fight that sin Kwan gave me the krogans they just their immune system is just so impressive and like they can take such a beating it's kind of scary to even be in a fight with them, let alone two of them let alone an army of them if need be but i'll stay out of this one guys if you don't but I leave it up to you to decide on the Predator or Rex and Grunt. And other than that, show some love to Sin Quan. This was his creation. Um, I really enjoyed doing it. Finally, I got to put some Mass Effect characters into my fights. Um, and I, I had fun doing it. So other than that, you guys stay tuned for the next fight. And you know the slogan.